sometimes God allows us to be placed in situations where he is the only one that can get credit for it. Sometimes you feel like that God or Christ isn't there in your life. You feel like, man, I'm going through this one by myself. Uh, you know, God, where are you? I'm, I'm at a crossroad. Um, it's real hard. And if you haven't had that experience in your life, um, I can guarantee you, you will have those experiences. Um, for me, the injuries I've had in football, the major injuries, um, I broke my leg. I thought that was going to be it for me in football. Um, and especially um, two seasons ago, I tore my Achilles tendon. Um, and doing that, people said, well, Greg, you know, even the doctor thought that that was going to be it. I thought that that was going to be it for me in football. Um, people said, well, his age going to really hurt him coming off of that kind of injury. He'll never get back. Um, my football team also drafted a first round draft pick at my position uh, because they felt like, you know, that's probably going to be it for Greg. It was, it was some real down times. God just had a different plan. He blessed me to be the um, comeback player of the year for the NFL. Uh, blessed me to have more sacks than I ever had in my career. Um, doing all of that, blessed me, blessed me to make my first Pro Bowl even. Uh, you know, it, when that happened, I can't take the credit for it. The doctors can't take the credit. The coaches can't take the credit. Um, all fingers have to point and say, man, if you follow this guy's story, you follow what happened to him, uh, you have to realize that there is a God, and He does show up and do miracles. My faith in Jesus is everything. It is my life. It just doesn't impact my life. Uh, and I don't say that being boastfully, but everything I do in my life, I always seek God first. Um, and not to say that I'm perfect and I make all the right decisions, um, but I base everything I do in my life off of Christ. I truly strive to make sure I'm doing it Jesus' way, putting Him first and letting people see that. Every time I'm blessed to make a play, if you notice, I'll, I'll get up and I point both fingers to the sky. I get teased by it and God said, why don't you get another celebration dance? And I'm like, man, all the things I've been through in my life, every time I go on the field, every play I'm blessed to make, I always want to acknowledge God and that's what I do. I'm Greg Ellis, and I am second.